That's kind of cool. I do like how they have a map sort of uh, organically there. No pun intended. <laughs> okay. Oof. Oh, wait. Communications is upstairs. That's where we have to go. Shit. I... Maybe we have to go through here? I'm... I'm nervous. I'm afraid. <laughs> no, my name is not Amy. <laughs> is this Carl? What are you? Are you blind? It's me. Carl. Carl Semke. Wrangler. Any of this sound familiar to you? I... no, actually. Well, thanks for being so helpful. It's not like I'm knocked out on the floor or anything. Um... Okay. Are you telling me those drawings were... Hello? Can you... Hello? Can you hear me? It's me, Carl, calling from the floor. Like, right next to you? <laughs> Are you human? Shit. Did, did my body give it away? I try hard saying mystery. Yeah, I'm human. Are you? Uh, my name is Simon. Do you know anything about this place? Oh, you're new. That makes us slightly less weird. Look, I'm obviously hurt. If you see anyone else around, just tell them where I am. So, where are you, exactly? Are you for real? I'm right here. See me waiting? Look at my hands. Hey, buddy! Okay, okay, I, I'm just I'm just gonna be... I, I'm not seeing it. I, I see a machine, a robot talking. What the hell are you looking at? I'm here! See? Okay. I just didn't expect you to look like that. You really hung up on appearances, you know that? <laughs> How did you hurt yourself? Not sure. Blacked out pretty bad. Can't remember how I got here. What do you remember then? I was in the pilot seat, promoting a UH. UH? A universal helper. You know, a robot like these things, but livelier. Anyway, I was just dealing with some heat shields and... That's my last clear memory. You were remote controlling a robot. We do it all the time. Robots are too on a way to deal with some stuff. Intuition doesn't grow on motherboards, you know. Did you maybe get trapped in the robot somehow? Your mind is pretty tightly wired to the helper, but nah, pretty far-fetched. Listen, I don't want to alarm you, but I think you might be trapped in a robot. I'm telling you, get your eyes checked. I'm right here. I see both my hands, both my feet. When you remote, all you see is like a video feed from the helper unit. Your own body is entirely out of the picture. I'm really hurting here. Go get some help. Okay. This person clearly thinks they are a human as we know it, but... What's wrong with your... everything? Are you diving in sewage or something? <laughs> Find someone who can help. Okay, interesting. Yeah, let's, let's investigate over here. It looks like... Do I want to... I don't know what this is. Will this open the door? What? Oh, maybe I shouldn't pull that down. Because he might be plugged into the system, not letting us, you know, open up the way to the comms tower. Mind giving a guy a hand? Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm investigating. This is a lot of information to take in, alright? Yeah, it seems like there's still quite a lot of energy being diverted here. So, I'm just going to keep looking around while we have a chance. Uh, let's see, anything? No, I literally cannot interact with nothing over here. Sorry. <laughs> okay, let me let me investigate, because there's also a lot of computers over here. I just kind of yada yada over. <laughs> so, yeah, when I activated this for the health, uh, the lights all went out, so there's probably something to do about that. All right, sticky note. Lockdown process initiated. Check terminal for details. Isn't this one? Oh, of course, ID numbers. Okay. Uh, well, let's try 25 is number one, right? Uh, invalid. Damn. Figured as much. Same thing over here. Damn. That's unfortunate. Okay. Uh, well, I take it that short of pulling that lever down there. I'm going to explore this area first. <laughs> I'm a little nervous because I think we have yet to see the end of our old friend over there. And I bet you anything we're going to have to hide here too, like in this little corner. Uh, no, I'm probably just looking too much into it. 
All right. Oh my God. He's dead. Oh, it's Carl. Oh no! How do we tell? Him? Yeah, he's kind of a handsome fellow, though. He looks kind of like Joel from The Last of Us. I don't know. <laughs> Nothing making me say that. All right. Sorry, I didn't mean to. <laughs> Never mind. Did you get the final backup turbos going? Everything is wired evenly. We've hedged our bets as much as we possibly can. So that's it. Enough power to run Pathos 2 until the next apocalypse. We're ready to go. I really hope we didn't mess anything up. I don't want to have to come back here again. Relax, it's over. We're going to Theta. Maybe we should seal more blocks. I don't trust the helpers to let this place run in peace. We've sealed everything. Everything from the barracks to the comm center. If anyone ever sets their foot here again, they're going to have a hell of a time getting around. <laughs> Okay, that's really unfortunate. So, 0722. Um, yeah, I don't know about you. This might just be like a like a limitation of the game, but I feel like he'd be more decomposed if it was over like a greater amount of time. This dude looks like he's been dead for three days or something. So, who knows? I'm also not digging the sounds of everything creaking around me. So flow control, this looks kind of important, right? There's a note in there. Can't read it. It says read before, I don't know. My vision is awful in games like this. And there's also an upstairs. So we've determined that our uh, big old bulbous hunchback monster friend has the potential to uh, climb stairs. And he can be real angry about it too. Theta, turn around. We sealed Upsilon to keep it working. Don't fuck it up. So, Azaro is Amy and Semkin was Carl. Carl was not my fault. Oh, that's so sad. Clearly, they were some kind of romantic item. You know, they were a unit. And they even they had the drawings together. That's so sad. Okay. I was wondering if we had anything to do with, uh, with either of them. But, oh, and here's hers. So, 0735. Oh, that's sad. Are we going to see Amy? Oh, God, we totally are, aren't we? All right. Amy, Carl, Catherine. Jesus. Even more stuff missing here, too. God. Okay. So if we step up. Oh. This must be a straight-up dead end. Ah, shit. Okay, I maybe should not have done that. If I open this, what would happen? Is there anything in here? No, this is a hiding spot for sure. Oh god. <laughs> Mind your head. Eh, I haven't had any complaints, but thank you. So, July 22nd and July 35th. Got it! Jesus. Let's go and, uh, punch those numbers in, shall we? <laughs> I have a feeling that's what we needed. There's also this door. See this this worries me a little bit. I'm going to I'm going to check it out. Let's see. That that is newly freshly murdered. There's also a vent here. Oh boy. Uh anything? Anything at all? <laughs> Amy, the badass. Okay. Yikes. Critical system failure. Carthage Industries. Thank you. Thank you so much. Alright. So, we need to find a way to get into that flow control area. Um, I'm going to actually double talk with Carl and see if we have any new dialogue because... Um, I hate to say it, but down the hall is your earthly body. Do you need anything? If you see any others, just let them know where I am. I'm really hurting here. Go get some help. Damn it. Alright, alright. So, let's go ahead and log on in and see if we can't get any information here. We'll go with, uh, clear. Oh boy. 0722. 
and ah, Carl Simkin. So let's check a look at the mail. Okay, so to Heather. Uh, power production has been secured. We sealed off the factories to keep the plant running. All superfluous systems have been turned off. Flip the switch. It's probably a no turning back situation. That's awful. But that was in my drafts. Uh-oh. Okay. Um. Yeah, that's that's awful. Let's let's send it. Oh, link cannot be established. Oh God, what are you doing? Okay, power manager, thermal chamber, not enough. So ah, here we go. Uh, comm center, insufficient power. Shut down one of the highlighted sections to divert power to the communication center. Okay, so that does look like the one in the upper left, the flow center, but also the one that I did before. Or that I almost did before. Okay, interesting. So, storage on. Oh, is that behind me? Siphon, or siphon, oops. You have to press back. Okay, let's try that again. <laughs> like this back. Uh, flow control on. I must have just opened the door to flow control then. Um, what about staff? So, Jane Adams, Vigdis, John Stott here, Baxter, all right. So Carl and I guess Ace Shish and Theta was a Wrangler. Interesting. And Amy was a field service technician. Okay, I think that's it. I think, do I have to come back to the computer when I divert the energy? I have a feeling I would have to maybe sacrifice Carl. Because that's going to cut off his power source, right? I very well may be spitballing. Who knows? Okay. So July 35th. Let's take a look. Amy Azaro. Okay, so unimportant stuff happening there. Energy output is low. So the year is 2103, maybe 04. Yikes. Almost 100 years later. That's crazy. Okay, this is the supplies. Okay. Let's take a look. Uh-oh. What is this? Sweet Jesus. The CCRV7 black box. The black box is a precision instrument designed to observe your overall condition. Uh, yeah, I think we know what a black box is. Why are you making so much damn noise, dude? This looks important. Is this a black box, perhaps? That's like a something. Interesting. Looks painful. Don't want to deal with that. There's also an iPod Nano in here. Love it. Gotta keep it retro. <laughs> I take it there's probably nothing in here, just a bunch of junk. Maybe pick at it, take a look. Next on the <laughs> on the docket is uh, this nail gun, which could be very helpful in the coming situations. Where I will probably die. Or a near endless supply of fire extinguishers. Jesus. Okay, he's got to be nearby, doesn't he? I keep wanting to listen. <laughs> he must just be fighting, fighting as hard as he can. Okay, well, um, I hope he doesn't come from down there, because I would have to come up here. But if I step over through this, you know, let me take a look at the flow room, the flow central hub. Let's see what happens here. So it is open. That's good. Oh god, just keeps getting more and more intense. Okay. We strain the system. If you pull the lever, there's no turning back. Make sure you want it bad enough. Oh, God. Okay, I'm going to try something. So, the, the instructions told me that I only had to go ahead and divert one of the power sources. This one seems a little closer to the door, so I feel like I'm a little safer if I'm over here in case I get attacked. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But I have to do it. <sighs> so long, Carl.
Um, I am so sorry. What the damn? You okay? Can you hear me? Hey. Hello? Oh my god, I fried his brains. Can you hear me? Shit. Okay, let me... <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> we'll try it one more time. <laughs> We, we have to. Wait, why isn't it working? I thought an, a monster was going to spawn, but I'm glad it's not. All right, power status has changed. There we go. Okay, I think we're set. Now we can go. Oh. God damn it. God damn it. Why? Why do you do this to me? Why do you make me... <laughs> That's awful. Okay, okay. There is, there's got to be another way, you know? Ugh, I can't do it. I can't do it. I'm sorry, Carl. I gotta go. I gotta get out of here. Let's leave. I'm so sorry. Okay, good. A monster doesn't spawn here. I was getting all worked up with nothing. Oof. Alright, well, something tells me that was maybe not the right way to do it. I'll keep that in mind for the future. Go for the flow central one instead. Well, um, did we make it? Is this dome ceiling? I don't know, man. Let's take a look. Corrupted data detected. I, I guess we can just restore it on our own. Why not? There we go. Nice. Oh boy. Uh, audio logs. Great. Josie, has a back on the We got everything we need to move, but we can't leave the plant without supervision. Adams decided to leave Amy, Asaro, and Kalsamkin to execute the automatization process. And I bet they're thrilled about it. I just wanted to let you know we're on schedule and I'll talk to you tomorrow. All right, I'll pass on the ball check. <laughs> I guess that was Jones dot here. Jonesy, lovely morning for an evac, am I right? It will do. I wanted to introduce you to Amy and Carl. They'll be doing the talking as soon as I leave for Theta. Say hello. Hey, Theta. Hello. Hey, guys, I'm Peter Stress, doing dispatcher at Theta. Just let me know if there's anything I can do to help. I suppose that's it. I'll see you real soon. When we arrive. Alright, Johnson, have a safe trip.